Hello. In this session, I want to discuss PTSD as a memory disorder. And while there are a lot of ways to think about PTSD, I think it aptly can be described as a memory disorder because of the impact that traumatic events can have on an area of the brain called the hippocampus. The hippocampus is the area of our brain that helps us process explicit, declarative, autobiographical memories. So the types of memories that you can actually remember when you try to. It just so happens that during traumatic events, the hippocampus does not function in the way it normally does, leading to memory encoding errors and processing errors, oftentimes leaving traumatic memories partially unprocessed. This in turn can lead to a lot of the symptoms that we see in PTSD. So in this session, I want to give you an explanation of how the hippocampus works, when it's working well, and also when it's not working so well during traumatic events, and want to say a little bit about what happens to the hippocampus over the long term if we remain too stressed or too anxious, how that can actually reduce the volume size of the hippocampus, and some practical skills and techniques we can use to begin rebuilding the hippocampus to be a little bit healthier.